Hold that for me. So to get a grip on the end of the steps, where you don't spend a lot of money, especially if it's going to be textured, whereas it's not perfectly flat and the tape isn't going to stick, what I use is one quart of the flat black Rust-Oleum protective oil-based enamel and one quart of Rust-Oleum white primer. Mix it together. Roll it on a small section at a time and then while you're rolling it on you sprinkle it with a little bit of sand By doing it like this, you're putting the sand on while the oil base enamel still has almost no surface tension. In other words, it's highly wet. You can't do a long strip. By the time you come back, the wind may have dried the top and it won't stick very well. I'm using ordinary Home Depot play sand. Play sand, as opposed to other forms of sand that they sell, is very clean. It has almost no dust or dirt in it. Dust or dirt just makes a, a lower quality work product. The rolls of tape will cost you about $20 for 60 feet, which might sound not that bad, but then if you look over there and you add all of these up, both sides of the building, you're talking a lot of money. This, by the end of the day, is going to cost 30 bucks. One thing you are going to have to remember is you're going to have to take the tape off while the paint is still damp mm. or, you know, it's tacky but not hard, otherwise it'll stick to the, uh, uh, the, the tape will stick to the paint and tear and won't lift up right. So you have to take it off before it gets to that point. You're giving your full time now. Well, Thomas and I, we went to breakfast this morning. Yeah. 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 Yeah.